Right, I came back to give the dwarf something, so let's grab that finally. There we go. And everybody else is done. We just got the dwarf to go. I'll try to keep an eye on Maru's uh, affinity. Let's just go here. Okay, so to town first. Let's talk to Clint. Upgrade my tools. I would like an Iridium Axe, please. We should be ready in a couple days. And now that I have basically a supply of Iridium coming my way at all times, it's a lot easier to justify making stuff with Iridium. Alright. Private property. What is that? Have some jade. It's now your private property. Nothing. Nothing. Still at six. We'll get there eventually. Let's head to level five. We'll take on the weak monsters and then we'll just progressively head down. And then once again, once luck is really on my side, we'll head back to the desert. Try to go deeper there, but... Uh, this is what I need to work on. I need to work on the mines. I need to work on killing enemies. I need to work on um, just my mining and combat in general. Those are the two skills that I have to deal with. So apparently the game thinks that I wasn't doing this enough yet. So we'll, we'll take care of that. No, Dougie. Killing slimes in the process. Don't need to kill the bugs anymore. We're, we're gonna get more copper. That can eventually be transmuted. Damn it. I'm more upset about the slow than anything else. There's a doggy. Alright, there's one more. Didn't we have to kill like 20 something more? Either way, we're gonna do it eventually. We're going to get all the achievements. I'm gonna make money. I do need to go back and double check how much the price was on some of this stuff. Uh, but we are making money in time. What does it take to make a... Uh, not the casks, the preserves jar. Where is the preserves jar? Is it not there? There it is, wood, stone, and coal. So, might make a few more of those simply because I can. I think I was saying no to that before, but there's still a lot that I need to do in the preserves jar, so I might make another row of them. They're pretty easy to make, apparently. Okay, so we've looped around. Let's try to find a way down. Doesn't really matter which way I go. There we go. Come on, Dougie. Nothing. If it's right in front of the, the ladder, it doesn't seem to spawn enemies inside the little areas there, but the rest of the level is kind of up for grabs. Did I grab that last one? Sure did. Die. Hey, there's a way down. Let's take that way down then. These early levels can go really quick. Mostly because they're not very big. I'm mainly here for Duggies. Once I'm done with them, I'll go further on, but they only appear up here. Which is why I'm hanging out here so much. I, th I got another Duggie. There we go. Two more Duggies. Grab that, grab that. Grab me all of that. And I think we're ready to go down again. Yep. Floor number 10. Gonna ignore that, it's not worth my time. 
So I believe the Duggies can show up till floor uh, 20. Because they're definitely here. I'm gonna try to get out of here before 10, just to ch check on progress. I so much prefer doing it here than with a play, well, a save analyzer that I can find online that I've been using for a lot of stuff. In this game, it's kind of required. I do know, for instance, that I've missed some of the scenes. Uh, there's one that I seem to have missed permanently. Uh, I had to get it in that first year, otherwise I don't get it, but the rest of them, We'll deal with at some point. All right, overrun with monsters. That's what I like to see. Doesn't seem all that overrun to me so far. Yeah, that wasn't overrun at all. Dougie? I got a monster floor and it was like nothing. Lots of dougie here. There's another one. All right, Monster Slayer goal complete. I got all the duggies that I needed. Well, uh, we'll just head out of here then. Since we got what we needed accomplished. You know, I don't know if I can catch another legend now that it's raining and it's way too late to think about it. I don't think I can. I think once you catch it once, it's it's it. You're, you're done. All right, how you doing, buddy? And we got a hard hat. Put that on. I feel like that's more deserved for me. I did more to earn that. All right. I think we're good. Now he'll sell me the hard hat for 20,000 gold. Jeez. That's a lot of gold for a hat. All right, let's head to the bus stop. We're pretty much done for the day. Let's try to wrap things up here. Wait, can I shake that? Yep. Get some salmon berries. All right, we have iridium here. Should have everything that I need to make more copper as well. All right, we'll grab that. More wine is done. More ancient fruit wine. Yeah, we'll keep on doing ancient fruit. Eventually, I want to move that warehouse over so that I can do the kegs in there. Uh, but clearly, that's not today. Oh, I don't have the coal required? Interesting. How much do I need? Uh, three. Okay, let's put the rest of this stuff away. At least the stuff that goes in here. Which isn't all that much, surprisingly. Uh, there's some stuff that goes in here, yeah? The amethyst, the quartz, earth crystals. Uh, cherry bombs can go in there. I guess I'll keep my spare hats in here. I don't know if I'm keeping them somewhere else, but it, it, like I haven't used them in so long. It's hard to keep track of where all my hats are going. Let's sell some stuff. We'll sell the daffodil, the uh, mayonnaise, and the truffle oil. We are done there. That can go in, so can that. Uh, the pickaxe and the katana can go in there. Oh, the iridium ore can go in there as well. Okay, let's check here, see what I need to put in the casks. Okay, 
there there is still room here we'll put the ancient fruit wine down here and eventually i hope this will work out for the best i hope As you can tell, I'm just not 100% on that. I don't know what's efficient in the game, even if I know what is the best to make more money in the long run. I don't know if it's more efficient to go that way. Okay, let's sell that horseradish. We'll put the, uh, the cheese in here. Can I talked to you already? All right, I did. Algae soup. That can be sold. I know it's getting late. You don't have to tell me, but they're going to anyway. There we go. Let's head to sleep. All right, on to day 16 of spring. We got 12,000 more gold my way. I do need to deal with the uh, the grass here. So we'll try to take care of that today. <laughs> All right, what does the weather say? Weather is clear and sunny tomorrow. Fortune teller says mildly perturbed, somewhat mildly perturbed. Let's say you should be done eight more iridium more. Have a cauliflower. All right, this is spectacular. I have to leave for work soon and I'll see you tonight. All right, fair enough. Couple cheeses done. Put one back, I didn't mean to, so we'll wait for that to finish. Grab it and leave. We already have cheese that can go in there as a replacement. Hello, Bob Scuba. This item was collecting dust in the tool shed. I figured you might be able to use it. Kent gave me a bomb. Don't keep that in the tool shed. So these cheeses can go in there before I forget. There we go, a couple spots for them. Yeah, they're... the aging process is uh, considerably taxing, but uh, we'll deal with that as we go. Okay, so do I have any iridium ore in here? I don't. I'm also short on coal. It's kind of surprising to me. We have nine of those left. All right, I'm gonna need the scythe for what we're gonna do today. There we go. Good stuff here. Now, I should make more of the what do you call it? Recycling machines, wood, stone, and iron bars. So let's make a couple of those. I was about to say, do I only have 144 stone? Nope, I have a complete stack for once. Okay, we'll make uh, three more of those. That should be good. Or, what is that? Two. I need 10? I think I need 10. Sure did. All right, so we're gonna get the fertilizer that I want out of that. Plop these down. I don't think I put bait in those, though. So we'll have to deal with that. Can't turn in the geodes today. Gonna have to wait till tomorrow. Come on, and there you go. Grab all that babe back. All right, how are things there? We're on day one? I'm missing one. Interesting. As long as you don't get all of it, it's good. Because then it still has a chance to grow. OK, 
I mean, that's good. I don't know how much hay we're actually getting here, but I hope it'll add up. So I have to kind of look up where the skeletons are in the dungeon, where some of the other stuff that I need to kill are. Uh, the Void Spirits are down near the bottom. I've been taking them on for a while. So the fact that I haven't killed enough is kind of concerning to me. But we'll deal with that. Now lots to kill. Lots of combat. Lots to mine. So the, ma the mines are the best place for me to go. To get all that done. Alright, let's just head down this side. With me and my hard hat. Not the reward that I was anticipating. Alright, so I heard a, a truffle pop up there. Looks like we're good here. No! Damn it! I didn't want to hit that. That one can go. I think we're fine though once I get everything going. Alright, let's head inside. Talk to all the animals, get all the truffles. Alright, that can stay open, it's fine. What do we have in here? We should have quite a bit. We do, because it was goat day today. Would love to have a... Hey! A rabbit's foot! When I wasn't even going to say that. I was going to say would love to have something that gives me the eggs the same way that they give me the milk that way, but I will take a rabbit's foot. Let's head in here and see if any more ancient fruit is done. It sure is. So everything is now full grown and should be giving me ancient fruit relatively regularly. Some of these are just kind of grew, so that might take a little bit, but... Yeah, the greenhouse is fully pumping now. More ancient fruit wine. Um, grab one more of those. Put it there. Get that going. Anything in here? Yes. Blackberries. So yeah, I might have to convert things into coal. The wood into coal. So that I can get some uh, better stuff. I think that's everything that goes in there, actually. Into the preserves, though, we have all that. And I think that's it. That can all go in here. I don't have any of that, so... Let's deal with this. We'll put Truffle in here. Talk to the dog. Okay, we can put the scythe away. Um, I forgot if there was room. Is there room for me in here? Uh, no. Okay, so let's sell the ancient wine. The ancient fruit wine. That can be sold. Ancient fruit wine, ancient fruit, uh, that truffle, and the torches. Okay, so we'll put this away. And uh, we'll go back into the mine. But first, we get on our horse and we go into town. Because over by the Joja Mart... There is a quest for me to complete, and a reward for me to get, and I'm giving him a rabbit's foot. Granted, it's an iridium rabbit's foot, and I really don't want to give that away, but I don't know how long it's going to take before I get another one, so we're just going to have to deal with that. Oh, I do need to go... No, it's Tuesday. I was about to say I need to go uh, get a gift for the dwarf, but I've already given him his two gifts. Uh, we just need to talk to him some more. Okay, so... Rabbit's foot. 
Hey kid, I need a lucky break. Bring me a rabbit's foot, I'll make it worth your while. There you go. I got a ring. You received the special charm. You feel an aura of good fortune surrounding you. Luck is permanently increased. That sounds good. I hope that it's good. It sounds good. I guess it's worth a lucky rabbit's foot to have a permanent luck increase. Maybe that means I can make it further into the desert mine on a day when the, the spirits are kind of on my side for a change. That'd be nice. Now let's head further up here and over into the mine. I'm, I, I know that I'm missing some of the bushes uh, that have stuff on them, but if it's not immediately on my way, it just doesn't always seem worth the effort. Like that one. That one's all right. Like salmon berries, what am I really doing with them anyway? 